News from the region and from around the state, this is a Florida Focus Environment Brief. Hello and welcome to Florida Focus. I'm Kayla Ewerts. Creating mats out of plastic bags, a group in Hernando County is recycling to help the homeless. Reporter Brittany Rosso explains. This is truly a community project. It's multicultural, multi-generational. Diana Sages coordinates mats for a mission. The volunteer group creates mats out of recycled plastic bags. The community grows through Mats for Emissions Facebook page, now at 200 people and counting. There's definitely a need for this project. Um, I believe there's a need for this kind of project in every community. Unfortunately, with the economy over the last few years, it's created a, a, a real need. Carly Nichols teaches at Fox Chapel. She sees this mission as a way for students to give back. I teach middle schoolers. We have 6th through 8th grade and they're at a time where um, they're very impressionable. And so it's really important that we try to build up a strong character base for them. The project's founder Eileen Kirkpatrick came up with the idea after watching a video on YouTube showing how to crochet mats out of plastic yarn. It takes up to 500 bags to complete one mat and up to two weeks to do it. Durable and environmental friendly, these mats give a place for people to lay their heads. If they get wet, you just dry them off. Bugs don't like them, but it provides a good layer between the person and the ground um, to prevent hypothermia and things like that. Knowing that we can provide them a place to sleep that's going to be comfortable, it's not on the ground, it's going to be a little bit cleaner, that's really what it's all about for us. Reporting for Florida Focus, I'm Brittany Rosso. Mats for a Mission meet Saturday from 9 to 11 at the Grand in Brooksville. Everyone is welcome to help. That's all we have for Florida Focus. Thank you for watching.